Choice admitted that he did not wait for Mimi's response because he wanted the views. I like that about a nigga. Hey, smoke! Ho! Oh. guys if you have not already done so please like and share this video because it is so important to my success here on the YouTube now let's talk about choice TV and it's lovely Mimi I fell in love with a new dude okay his name is choice TV and let me tell you why he's so intriguing to me because he eats and it, it, it doesn't get on my nerves. Because I can't lie, y'all. Them mukbangs with that. It's just, oh, my God. It makes me feel like your mother never gave you, like, instructions as a child. Because at my house, in my house, in my grandmother's house, everything. If you chewed with your mouth open, it would be some repercussions. Yeah. The first thing, nay, nay, close your mouth when you chew. Do you hear me? Close your mouth. That, if you don't know how to do it, figure it out. I've, I've stopped fucking with people over chewing with their mouth open. Do you hear me? I mean, that's how serious it is with me. But anyway, he's a whole mukbanger slash celebrity blogger, right? And I think he's almost 40. And he looks beautiful. Like his skin is beautiful. I think he's vegan or something. But anyway, child, I'm talking too much about the dude. I don't know if he's gay or not. I don't know. I don't know this young man. I don't know him, right? But anyway, I found him because he was talking about my homegirl, Mimi. It's lovely Mimi, the girl who played on Love and Hip Hop. She's a um uh Instagram sensation. She's like a moneymaker. Now, now, what's going on is her and her husband have broken up on the internet. When I tell you that is so horrific to me because you're putting your life out there to entertain people with your life. For whatever people reason that people want to watch the family so that um, they can... I don't know. Maybe they, you know, the the subscribers want to see a family life that they don't have. I don't know, but she got a lot of sub subscribers now. Now she also, you know, Vietnamese girl or Asian girl, you know, that's gotten her work done on her body, and that also could be part of the reason why she got a lot of views. Okay, I don't know, but she's very entertaining to me right i know her from back home i'm not gonna say how i know her brother but i know her i met her because of her brother okay and that's all i'm gonna say you know i went to the shop and um you know she was regular she was real real regular i think it, the shop was even in district heights or capital heights i forget which one but it's a heights goddamn it sure. right but anyway um what happened was choice initially said that you know Mimi was a whole you know but about the situation about her and her husband breaking up choice admitted that he did not wait for Mimi's response because he wanted the views I like that about a nigga that's, that's like Remy first came out and he told his explanation I looked Remy up Remy is old Libra Hey, I, hey, a Libra man, y'all are not among my favorite people. Y'all are not my favorite people because, you know, even though I'm a Libra woman, hey, I, I, I always told y'all that I would never de deal with me. It's about the situation or, or Remy's initial response of about the situation was, you know, she had all these people living with her. Um, she was taking advantage of me and um she was getting drunk she was gambling and he basically exposed a lot of things about her that i felt like you know was inappropriate i did i did but it painted him as a victim you know and sometimes libra men and leo men can always haul a victim it's always somebody else's fault okay and then let me get this straight i never knew that remy had a uh youtube channel i mean uh Okay, but 
then we get to Mimi's situation. And child, when I tell you a lot of things, you know, I really, you know, I believed her on the situation. But then I was like, uh, I don't know, girl, because on one second she was saying, okay, she was leasing a house. Then, you know, she was talking about foreclosure. Then she was saying that she was behind bills on all these different um uh, businesses that Remy opened and then just walked away from. And then, you know, she was like, well, I'm up to par now. Like, I don't know what to think really. But what I do believe about Mimi's situation is that, um, I do believe that she had Remy's back. Her. You know, she believed in Remy so much and wanted to help him to be a better man so much that all her YouTube money and all her promotion money from Fashion Nova was going to her husband. I will not call her dumb in that situation because when you believe in your mate, that's the kind of thing you do. Mimi, hey girl, me and you don't, I don't know you. We don't be kissing each other in the mouth like that. You know, we, you know, I've only had one interaction with you, but let me stay for the record. I have no qualms with you doing whatever you need to do to lift your man up. Absolutely no qualms. So okay. let me say this. Quite honestly, you know, Remy talked about how it was so many people living in the house that, you know, weren't paying bills, blah, 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 you know. And I'm going to tell you, I don't have a problem with that. In my family, it's not like a lot of people live with us. But trust me, in my family growing up, if ever I had a Judy, that I'd be like, Ma, you know, I want her to, you know, can she stay with us or blah, blah. My mother would open the door. Our family, we believe in, you know, helping people, bringing people in. You know, we've never really, I can't, I don't have, I don't have that judgment in me to be like, why she got so many people living in her house. In our family, you stay home. Whatever friends you got, they come to our house. And, you know, it's also a control issue, you know, because my mother would be like, oh, no, you're not about to be over that little girl house every day. I don't know that little girl. She could come stay with us. Come on. Since you're going to be with her every day, tell her, pack her bags, come stay with us. And it, it just was like that. I was, I, our household, if it wasn't me having a, you know, BFF living with us, it was my little sister that had a BFF living with us. That's just what it is. Mimi, in turn, said, well, I got people living with me, but you got people living with us, too. And some of them people that live with us put me in bad situations. Another thing that I want to talk about before I move on, right? What Mimi talked about was that she had a gambling issue. That's the same thing that Remy exposed about her. It, it, I'm telling you, it breaks my heart that you can be in love with somebody and expose them. If you ever say, I love you to somebody, you cannot hurt them. To me, anybody, anyway, guys, I'm, I'm getting in my feelings about some things. But and Mimi, she apologized for saying, I'm sorry for making you think that we had the perfect household. Shasta La Vista, Mimi, I have no problems with you, you know, especially when you're on a public platform. You're not the only person to do it. You know, me stars run around here miserable like shit with their mate, but they know that they make more money together than they do separate, so they stay together. Can, child, can you imagine? How long Angela, J Jolie, and Brad Pitt was faking it? Shh, Brad Pitt made it seem like he ain't had pussy for years. Child, okay. after she did that video, Troy TV came back and then he told the other part of it, right? Child, and then he talked about how they was dragging the frig out of Remy, okay? But this is the thing. Remy, you started it. You started this shit. You started it because you did not have to come out and make a video, but you knew you had to do something. You knew you had to get on a public platform because your money was gone. You was used to getting money handed to you. So what you had to do was hurry up, jump on board to the YouTube and start collecting your check. He's monetized according to Trost TV. I haven't watched the dude. I'm not subscribing to him. I'm not going to support um, him. I'll support Mimi, but I won't support him. You know, when she made the video, the response video, Choice made his video, child. What Choice included in the video was Remy's response. But he hurried up and took it down, child. He hurried up and took it down. 
because you know also that there were some allegations about Mimi, um, you know, taking drugs, right? Mimi has never denied. I didn't see videos back two years ago where she did not talked about popping a e pill, you know, whatever it is she want to get to, girl. You better get that shit under control. That means you know you be around this motherfucker with Percocet problems. Okay, girl. That's what you might want to do. You want to get that shit under control, girl. Video. Choice TV did a response. Chow bang. Okay. And what he did in his response was provide a video where Remy was doing a clap back on her, where he talked about how she was bipolar and that she was on medication. Now he deleted the video, oh, but Choice got it. Choice, I don't know who you are, but you's a bad motherfucker. Also allegations about him being abusive towards Mimi. And there were other videos that Choice found. Love you, baby. Where she had admitted that she's very aggressive. So I believe it was a situation where they was just, you know, putting their hands on each other, which is not cool for anybody. You need to learn how to express your anger or your frustrations out another way because I'm not going to wake up with a bruise on my face, goddammit. This my money maker. And then I remember one time where she did a video and it was a bruise on her breast. And then she was like, don't worry about that bruise on my breast. I'm saying, what the fuck you mean? Don't worry about the bruise. So ultimately what I would say is that, um, you know, I, I hope they work it out or don't work it out. I don't see how they could get back together after this, but Shasta La Vista to them all right guys if you have not already done so please like and share this video because it's so important to my success here on the youtube now remember this the same people you meet on the way up will always be the same people you meet on the way down naysayers my patron loves have a good one deuce